Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to add and subtract mixed numbers with different denominators. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, add 2 and 1 half plus 5 and 2 thirds. Well, we got some mixed numbers and have different denominators. So basically, we're writing it like, let's write it vertically, 2 and 1 half plus a 5 and 2 thirds. Now my first step here is I want to have, well, the fraction part over here as a common denominator. We don't have that. We have a 2 and a 3. So if I want to rewrite this to have a common denominator, well, 2 and 3, the LCD, right, of these two numbers here, is a 6. So I would have a 1 over 2 and I have a 2 over 3. The 1 half, I can multiply the numerator and denominator both by 3. That gives me a 6 in the denominator. And then the 2 thirds, both by 2. 2, two times 3 is also a 6. From there, keep on going. We have 2, 1 times 3 is a 3, over 2 times 3 is a 6, plus 5, 2 times 2 is a 4, over 3 times 2 is also a 6. Well, now we can add these numbers here. Let's go down. 2 plus a 5 is a 7. We're adding. We have the same denominator as a 6 here in the fraction. We add the numerators. 3 plus 4 is a 7. Now, remember, 7, 6 is too much, right? It's not equal to a whole number. It's past that. And so what I would need to do is rewrite this. I mean, the 7. 7, 6 is a 1 and 1 6. So we're left with just a good old 7 plus 1 is an 8 and 1 sixth here. And there we have it. 2 and 1 half plus 5 and 2 thirds comes out to be an 8 and 1 sixth. I hope you learned something here on how to add and subtract mixed numbers with different denominators. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.